Hey guys, it's Nikki here, and today I'll be reviewing Goliath Yelps with her scooter. And after I'll be reviewing Dracula in her bathroom, but not just yet. Next video. Um, so there's a really, really brief story about Gulia. Um, I was my mom was gonna order her online for me and Draculaura, but uh, she decided to call the local Toys R Us, and we realized that they were there. So we had them put them aside for us, and then we got to the store. They had put the ones without the dolls aside for us. So I figured, oh no, what if they're not there? But then my mom got the lady to check if they were in stock, and then we went to the toy aisle, and the lady was looking like in the main section where the toys were, like just the obvious place. But then me and my mom spotted on the top of the shelf that we saw Gulia's hair. We just saw this part of the box and we saw Gulia's hair and we're like, those are it, those are it. And then the lady grabbed grabbed the two boxes and yeah. And then like it was like really, really rainy that day. Before we got in, it was extremely cloudy. We saw some lightning, but then like we ended up getting stuck in the store because it was like pouring rain. And when I say pouring rain, I mean like Niagara Falls pouring rain. Like it was just coming down like crazy. So yeah, that was a pretty fun experience for all this. All right, enough with the story. Um, before I start reviewing Gulia, I'm gonna review her box. Uh, let me just move Gulia because I'm scared she's gonna fall. Because like I just did this video before and uh, she fell. Okay. So at the top it says Monster High. Okay, and that's where the doll went right there, and it says Scooter. And there's Gulia on her scooter. Here's the Monster High logo, and it's Monster High along the side. Oops, sorry. There's some pictures of Golia. See my knees? <laughs> sorry, I'm kind of crowded here. Um, here's the back of the box. That's my water, let me just move that. Here at the top, it says Monster High. There's the Monster High logo, and it says Scooter. And then it shows here, and it says bone details. There's the picture again. And here it says drink cup. And then it shows Draculaura's playset at the bottom. And on top it says woo! Woo and who? Okay. <laughs> that, was, that was terrible, I'm sorry. Yeah, and nothing not side. And the bottom is just, as always, a bunch of writing that no one reads. Cool, right? I actually like this box. It reminds me a lot of um, the Coffin Bean box and um, Draculaura. Uh, no, not Draculaura. Uh, the Vanity Set. That's it. Okay. So getting to Gulia. Wait, I really pray I don't knock her over because this thing's so sensitive. So before I review the scooter and the accessories. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, that needs to come off anyway. Okay, I'm gonna show you Gulia. Please don't knock over. Please, please, please. Merci. Okay. Does not come with a stand, by the way. So she has like the bright blue hair and it's all wavy and it's really soft, not gelled or anything. And around her eyes she has, uh, let's see, I think that's a blue shadow and uh, red all around it. Sorry, again, no glasses. Um, that's like a turquoise lipstick she has on. And for her earrings, wait, let me just check what that is. Oh, they're the bones like two one she has on the one of the beach dolls. I forgot whether it's Gloom Beach or Skull Shorts that she had those earrings. Um, so here she has this little vest thing. It looks like the Werecat twins the way they wore it. Except it's white and there's a little zipper. And her dress looks like blood splatters. And see it's like this kind of dress. No V or anything, covers up. And uh, it's grey, red and white kind of splattery. And here are her sick biker boots. How cool are these? They're like so awesome. Anyway, so there's the little monster high skulls there. And the little buckle. Really nice. Yeah, they come off in the back like that. So that's the Gulia. Let me just show you Sir Hoots a lot. Oh, this thing is so like. Okay. Here, it com he comes with a helmet and uh, glasses that attach on. See, like it all comes apart. And yeah, that's so hoots a lot. And uh, this is Gulia's helmet. Wait, hang on. Sorry, this review is longer than I expected. Um, it has like a white stripe and it kind of looks like a cap. And there's a Monster High logo right there. And uh, it has an attachment of glasses because you know Gulia needs to see. 
Here, it comes with a backpack. It's a, shaped like a coffin, and there's Ghoulia's little skull there. A little details over here, and a, the skeleton hand coming out of it. And then a little, uh, kind of looks like belts for the straps. Cute, right? Uh, okay, her scooter is, like, really nice. So let's start off with the front. Hopefully I don't forget anything. This, there's the light, but it doesn't really work. Has little black and white strings over here. Over here on the sides, there's bones to hold. And there's Gwilya's logo again, and the the rear, the, I mean the view mirrors here, there are skeleton hands, and here I think it's supposed to be ribs, kind of. And yeah, Sir Hoots a lot hangs out there. White stripe going down the scooter, and uh, looks like kind of like a blood drip here. Oop! Cup. <laughs> there's a green cup with blood drip, I mean like goo dripping, and then the top, she's swirly, and yeah. And just in case she gets thirsty. And here, see on the wheel, there's the drips, and then there's the monster high logo skull there and then there's a the skeleton hand holding it now there's the bones over here for the stopper so it stays up you see and uh, wait, let's go towards the inside okay there's like some little uh, engine things there I don't know what those are called some handles and there's a basket again for Sir Hoots a lot there's the bone details you see like looks like a spine going up here's her cushion here it's red and she has like the cherryish designs here I don't remember where I saw that before I don't know, I've seen that before on Monster High. And this is like a little trunk, it opens, but you can't really fit much inside. It's like little crossbones on there. And some things in the back here. And these are, uh, I don't know what that's called, but it has, looks like flames here. And then there's some gears and uh, her skull logo. Oh, wait. Let me just set her back up, or sort of set her back up. Okay. So, I think that's pretty much it for the Ghoulia Scooter review. Be sure to comment, like this video, subscribe to me if you already haven't. And, um, I hope you guys have an awesome uh, rest of summer and awesomeness. <laughs> okay, bye guys.